Hello my friends, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we'll be talking about the best cities in Germany for job opportunities. Germany is famously known as the economic powerhouse of the European Union. It has a very robust economy with a very low unemployment rate. There are a lot of very robust industries within Germany, such as the automotive industry, the mechanical and electrical engineering industry, chemical engineering industry, just to mention a few. Germany has internationally renowned brands and companies such as Daimler, Porsche, BASF, Siemens, and so on. They are all headquartered in Germany now before we get into the video you guys know how we do it if you're not subscribed please subscribe click the subscribe button and the notification bell so that you'll be notified every time I post a new video and it's a way of supporting the work I put into creating this video and don't forget to give the video a thumbs up as well and if you would like to follow me on Instagram you can follow me it's at Wale O Chronicles and if you would also like to sign up for my one-on-one -on -one five week coaching program for those who want to study in Germany or work in Germany then visit my website the link is in the description box below and sign up for a free consultation session now with all that being said let's get into the main tea and gist of this video of course the first city I will talk about on this list is Berlin which is where I am located Berlin is the capital city of Germany once again and it's the most populous and metropolitan city in Germany with a population of 3.5 million people as I said in my previous video, it seems like the whole world wants to move to Berlin right now, which is very good, but also driving up the rental prices. So just be aware of that. If you've not seen, I spoke about uh, the most expensive cities in Germany in my previous video. I will leave a link in the description box. Go and watch that video. I talked more about the expenses in different cities in Germany and Berlin was on that list as well. If you do not speak German or your German is still growing or you're learning German and you're not there yet, Berlin is the best place, one of, I would say, one of the best places to look for a job in Germany because there are many startup it has a very very robust startup scene and also there are many international companies located in berlin where the official language is english so there are chances that you will find something without speaking so much german however i will highly recommend and advise from my own personal experience that it's just better to just learn the language because this is generally speaking across board even if you do get a job without speaking German and you're working in a global company, English language speaking company, I feel like there is a glass ceiling that you cannot break through in your career if you do not speak German. So it's only going to be to your own benefit if you do speak German. Now, having said that, there are so many English language speaking qualified people in Berlin because like I said, it seems like the whole world wants to move to Berlin. So the competition for English language speaking positions in Berlin is very, 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 very stiff and tough because everybody, many people, well, many English language speaking people do not speak German. So you will find people competing with you for the roles. So if you know how to speak German, it only serves as an advantage for you then because then you will have many more options than people who only speak English. Famous um, companies in Berlin include Google, Zalando, Idealo, 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 I think that's how it's pronounced, and a massive startup scene. So there are like tons of startups where you can apply and get a job easily without speaking any German. The next city on this list is Frankfurt and Main. As I said in my previous video about the most expensive cities in Germany, Frankfurt is the financial hub and financial capital of Germany. It is the most important financial hub within the European Union. There are many financial institutions within the city and also the German Stock Exchange as well as the European Central Bank also have their headquarters in this city as well. Also, many financial institutions have their headquarters within the city. So if you're interested in a career within investment banking, finance, um, and so on related, then Frankfurt is where you should be and Frankfurt is where you should be looking for jobs. Other um, prominent employers within the city include PWC, Deloitte, uh, Procter & Gamble, uh, Deutsche Bahn, and so on. 
If you would like to find out more about what it's like living in Frankfurt, the experience, cost of living, uh, what it's like as a foreigner and so on, I made a video about that. I will also leave it in the description box below and I will leave it in the card somewhere. So go and watch that video to get more information about living in Frankfurt. The next city on this list is Hamburg. Hamburg, I can see a bit of similarities between the cities I'm mentioning now and the list I mentioned of most expensive cities in Germany. So, of course, where there are more job opportunities, the more people flock to those cities and the more people flock to those cities, the higher the demand for rental properties within the city and then the higher the um, rental prices go, like when the demand for uh, accommodation is high, the prices go up and so on. Economics, you know how it goes. So, it's interesting that the cities get expensive because there are lots of job opportunities in the cities. Anyway, so Hamburg, we're talking about Hamburg before I went off on a tangent, right? Hamburg has one of the biggest seed ports in Europe, so the um, port authority also have like they have a lot of roles and they hire a lot of people, but mostly if you have to speak German to be able to break into that kind of environment. However, the manufacturing industry in Hamburg is actually very, very robust as well. The famous brand um, um, of Nivea, the people that produce Nivea, they are called Biesdorf. Biesdorf whatever i don't know how to pronounce it biasdorf or biasdorf is also the headquarters is located in hamburg and there are a massive employer of labor within this um, region as well other massive employers here include google uh unilever chibo they produce chocolates um and other things henkel is also a massive employer within this place as well as well as uh airbus airbus also a massive employer in this region of course, this list will not be complete if I do not mention Munich. I think I should have put it at number one, but I'm not putting them in any particular order. I'm just mentioning the best cities for job opportunities in Germany. So Munich, of course, one of the most expensive cities in Germany, surprise, <laughs> has a lot of job opportunities and is equally expensive. The pay and salary, the pay salary, it's relatively higher than other parts of germany but so is the cost of living in munich munich is the largest city in bavaria and also the richest city in bavaria which is no surprise is this why it's also so expensive though i don't know there are many active industries in munich such as tech science research trade hospitality food and beverage you name it there's a plethora of active industries in munich Big employers within this region also include Puma, Google, Microsoft, Intel Corp, BMW, Airbus, just to mention a few. I could go on and on about massive employers in Munich. So if you're looking for a job and you're not located in Munich, please start applying in Munich, although you have to make sure that you got some money because that place is expensive. So make sure you negotiate for a very good salary because Munich is expensive and you'll be spending a lot of money. But Munich got jobs, guys. Got jobs. Okay. All right. Now, moving on to the next city on this list. The next city on this list is Stuttgart. Stuttgart, as I said in my previous video, is a city in the western part of Germany or the south, depending on how you look at the southwest of Germany in the state of Baden-Württemberg. Many big multinationals have a very strong presence in this city, including Daimler, Porsche, Amazon, IBM, and so on. Of course, with many multinationals like this, there is a there is a demand for a huge spectrum of skills from finance to HR to um, software developers to engineers to to scientists and so on. So the spectrum is very large. So if you're looking for a job, Stuttgart, that's where you should go. <laughs> The next city on this list is Dusseldorf. Some of the major industries in Dusseldorf include health services, industrial technology, manufacturing, and fashion. Many of the big consultancy firms also have um, presence in Dusseldorf. So some of the big top employers in Dusseldorf include KPMG, Accenture, Deloitte, PwC. Ernst & Young also has a presence here as well. Vodafone, Henkel, Logiel and so on. The next city on this list is Cologne, one of my favorite cities in Germany because they party hard. Woo! Okay, this is a serious video. Let me come back to my serious self. So, some of the um, biggest industries in Cologne are the manufacturing industry, 
uh, the automotive industry as well as the media industry. I think for the media industry, you need to speak German. So maybe we should just leave that a bit because I feel like many of the people that watch my video, maybe they don't speak German or whatever. I don't know. But the media industry is also very present in Cologne as well. Some of the top employers within um, Cologne include IBM, KPMG, Bayer, Ford Motor, Microsoft, and so on and so forth. So the next city on this list is Leipzig. It's so interesting that Leipzig is the only city on this list that does not, is it the only one of the cities on this list that is not on the expensive list that I made in the previous video, most expensive cities, but it is on the cheapest cities in Germany video that I made. So if you get a good high paying job in Leipzig, then you hit the jackpot because you are living in one of the cheapest one of the cities considered a cheap city in Germany and you're being paid a very good salary as well. The automotive industry is very present in Germany and some of the top employers include the BMW Group, Porsche and Dell Technologies. The next city on this list is called Darmstadt. Darmstadt is in the state of Hesse and some of the strongest cities within this uh, city are the pharmaceutical industry and the chemical industry as well as biotechnology, media and communications and so on. Some of the top employers in this region include um, KFV, that's KFW, that's the development, one of the development bank of Germany. Procter & Gamble also has a massive presence here. Deutsche Telekom also has a massive presence here. So Darmstadt is a mid-range city, it's not super expensive, it's not very big and then the salaries also in this area are quite very well paid. The jobs here are very well paid and the salaries are considered high compared to some other eastern parts of Germany for example. So other cities for jobs um, opportunities that I will not go too deep into in this video include Bonn, Dortmund, Hannover and so on. The list is endless. I will just stop here so that this video does not get too long. I want to say a big thank you if you've watched this video up till this point. I really appreciate your support. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and watch my other videos that I mentioned. The link is in the description box below and I will see you in my next video. Bye!